So what, what is the difference between last second edition and third edition? See, every time we do a program like this, two things happen. One is that we get to meet uh, a new set of uh, entrepreneurs, and every time that we meet these entrepreneurs, we see the quality of entrepreneurs improving. Uh, this is a long journey. We are half, not even halfway through. It's been just uh, five years for the state uh, to have embarked upon this journey of building the entrepreneurial ecosystem with regards to the startups uh, in Assam. Uh, and and uh, my personal experience has been that uh, uh, this has really evolved to a level that uh, you know today we are compa- our startups are comparable to anyone across the country. So so you know there there is no dirt of. T- uh, um, uh, you know, talent pool here. The talent pool was leaving uh, Assam and trying to do this startup from outside the state, but today they are here. They want to build uh, for uh, build in Assam for Assam, and that's the greatest thing. And also take it out from Assam. So that is happening, and I'm very, very, uh, uh, very, very, uh, uh, what do you say? Uh, optimistic about the fact that uh, uh, good things in this uh, space will happen here in the coming times. And looking forward to it. Okay. So, how an entrepreneur can approach you for all these kind of connections and to grow themselves further and become a part of this kind of events? See, these are open events. We publish about the event in social media, uh, in our social media handles, where through which people come to know, and people know that we've been doing this for a while and we're serious about this, um, uh, you know, the kind of things that we do. And that's why you see this kind of, uh, you know, people participating. And every time the uh, numbers are swelling, uh, which gives us the feeling that uh, we are in the right track, we are doing the right thing. Uh, and uh, uh, your next part of the question: How can people approach us? We have different platforms through which people can approach. We do different programs. We do something called the Idea Clean, which we have not done for some time now, but we'll be soon doing it. Where again, you know, uh, people can register and uh, you know they come, they join a, a web call, and through that we try to address their uh, you know queries and needs and help them start off if they haven't and uh, if they have any problems if we can solve it there and then we try to solve it if not then we call them to our office and then we meet them and do a one-on-one mentoring and try to resolve the issues and uh, you know, help them move forward okay so last question like which startups or which ideas i am calcutta innovation park think as the best idea that can move ahead in future see whomever we support we think are the best ideas that's why we take in we are uh, we are um, domain agnostic we do not believe that we will only work in a particular uh, segment only thing that we do not because we have a socialist uh, socialistic approach towards entrepreneurship we feel that any uh, any initiative that we help has to have a impact in the society that we live in and that's why we do not participate in any any uh, initiative or any uh, uh, startup uh, which are in uh, uh, you know uh, in domains where it doesn't have direct impact in the society things like you know if someone is creating something in the gaming sector or uh, maybe in the alcohol or you know uh, those kind of you know uh, stuff that's where we don't you know yeah. participate otherwise we are domain agnostic and whomever we onboard and we handhold we believe they're the best okay. so that's that's why we we hold uh, handhold them and well this is a journey and um, it's also onto the entrepreneurs themselves the founders themselves how far they can you know take it because uh, we cannot run the business for them we can only show them the direction we can handhold them we can take them to a level and beyond that they have to you know take their business forward okay.